guys, what's good? We are back. Today I am going to play for Chelsea against Swansea and I am really looking forward to that. I'm going to go and work my hardest, work for my team and score lots of goals and do good dribbles and just smash it today. I hope that we will have fun and enjoy ourselves and win all of our games and hope that I will just do what I do and enjoy it. So catch me when I'm doing that. Peace. Uh, yes, guys, what is happening? We are off to Cobham. I am so excited. Yep. I love seeing my boy play. Um, and I love him with a smile on his face and doing things he loves to do. Um, guys, it is the... Let me check what the day is. Oh, my phone's... 10th of April and it is a Tuesday and um, I don't think we've let you know but we're actually on Easter break so it's like it's called half term so that's why the kids haven't been doing like homeschool work and stuff and um, all the schools are off so the clubs you know are running stuff through the weeks uh, usually it'll be like Saturday games but now um, it's Tuesday so they're filling up the boys time which is great so we are gonna fly off to Cobham now it's quarter past 11 we're meant to be there for 12 so that means we'll probably be five ten minutes late um, but what's new eh mm, sorry apologies catch you in a bit Peace enjoy your son game I what will. enjoy your son game enjoy your game yeah. son ah! take care buddy love you yeah yeah so yeah, um, as you can see, I'm tired. Um, but yeah, he's just gone off to, to play his game. So uh, I'm gonna go and watch. Um, it's not raining at the moment, and I'm hoping it's gonna stay that way, but I'm not that hopeful. So yeah, we'll catch you in a sec. Wow, Hezzy, <laughs> guys, uh, Hezzy was a lot today. Well done, son. 
Thanks. Very, very well done. Did you enjoy yourself? Yeah. <sighs> what is you running up like you... Boy, you had some stamina today. Running all the way back, all the way up, all the way back, all the way up. Anything to say about the game? It was a good experience. And I thought I'd done really well and scored loads of goals and done lots of dribbles and good As passes. Assisted, yeah, assisted loads. Yeah. Like yeah. I told you what I was going to do in the morning. <laughs> Fair enough. Say no more, fam fam. Ah. Hey, down there. Home sweet home. Let's go get them. Hello, my pretty girlies. Hello. 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 Are you all okay? Yeah. What have you been doing? Something. You've been watching something? Yeah. And what are you eating? Maybe some pasta. Some pasta? Some chicken and some salad. Ah, cool. It did have salad in it, but I ate all my salad. Ah, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Have you been alright? Yeah. We've missed you. Yeah. What's that? <laughs> Eat my food? Yeah. What, have I got food as well? Where is it? Is it in the kitchen? Yeah. Ah, okay, shall I go and get it now then? Yeah, please. Okay, cool, all right then. You nearly got him here. Who, who jumped? Harper. Harper. <laughs> oh, did you jump? Yeah. <laughs> yes, guys, so we're literally um, about to. Jeez, Louise is going to break the net. Um, yeah, we're literally about to um, go out now. We was going to um, come home and whatnot, but we are going to go to Jessup's and sort out this madness. So, um, yeah. We're going to see how that goes. Whoopsie, holes in the net. Yeah. Like Cadence today. Oh, right there. <laughs> Girls, you coming out? Yeah. Yeah? Come out, come out, wherever you are. Yeah, so um, we're going to go Jessup's and try and get that. They're very excited. Um, we're going to go Jessup's and try and get some justice for the stupidness that we incurred. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll catch you in a sec. Ah, you got me, baby girl. You got me, mm. guys. Subscribers, whose hand is this? I'll give you one guess. Daddy. Well, this is Daddy's, yeah, but whose is this one? How about oh, well, then, then there you go. There's your guesses. All done. Uh, done. <laughs> uh, finger. Ah, oh, finger. I love you. I do. Alright, so this is one of them times, right, where I don't know if you've had these, but I feel like we're going to go in there and they're just going to say, oh, we're really sorry for your inconvenience and blah, 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 blah. What's tell happening? them where to go and stick their inconvenience. No. <laughs> we're going to go in and we're going to be as graceful as we possibly can. And that's funny coming from Ella, because Ella's the more political one out of the two of us. Fight. Oh my day, listen to her. I'm ready for a fight. You ain't ready for no fight. You don't do no fighting. It's just so disappointing for me. Or maybe I shouldn't speak too early, but I will anyway. Um, I assume it's gonna be long and they're gonna be like, oh, no, it's, oh, I'm sorry, man. I'm really sorry. Yeah, or here's five pounds off your next purchase. Five pounds. I'm not gonna disclose, you know, what was spent because it's, it's distasteful, but. Five pounds off your next purchase won't be sufficient. Let me just say that. But anyway, guys, let's go and see what they're saying. I'm not obviously going to take this in. We're going to go and deal with it, you know, in a nice, proper way. But here's to hoping. Jessup's get better because you're rubbish right now. So, guys, oh, as you can same see, same um, we've just come out of Jessup's. Guys, was it a great result or not? No. No. We are still in the process of waiting to find out what's going to happen. And I've got to send them an email with all the details of everything that we've experienced. The first guy that we dealt with seemed like he didn't really want to help out much at all. But the second guy looked like 
Hopefully, we might be able to. I, I believed in David. Like it's funny, the kids. What I found really interesting was the kids were um, very attentive because when we came out, um, Hezzy, what did you say? Come round here because they might not be able to hear. You. Just go in there and just speak. Just tell the viewers what you thought. That first guy they were talking to sounded very untrustworthy, and then the second guy, David, he seemed like he might might be able to help. Well, there you go, and that's it's out of the mouth of babes. I'm telling you, like when you get, um, you know, older and stuff, and you have to start like being politically correct and all that kind of stuff. That's when you know. Uh, I think we complicate things. Kids have it really right. Like I, I really do. A lot of the time, they call it how they see it, and usually, how you see it usually it is what it is so yeah um yeah well we're gonna go and get something sorry hazzy we're coming we're gonna go and get some hair gel and then we'll catch up with you lot in a second peace out hey guys so whilst we're in bromley we just thought we would come pick up some hair gel because the last time i bought the hair gel it was a big tub and now i'm um, using it on about four or five children's hair every day it's finished so i need to get some more eco styler gel so i'm gonna get that now they've got this new one it's like a coconut one and um yeah it just really doesn't flake in the hair which is good so this is like my local hair shop so it's sabina's hair and cosmetics in bromley so this is the styling gel that I usually use eco styler gel and it's the coconut oil one so that's what I use in the kids hair and in my hair but they haven't got of any of that one in the size that I want today so I can just see another new one down here what is this one black castor oil and flaxseed I might try that no flake no tack anti itch oh I might try this one actually yeah let's try that one today Oh, you saw a lady using the Cantu Shea Butter Collection. On you, where did you see it? On YouTube. You saw it on YouTube, okay. Well, that's a good way to find out what kind of products we might want to use, but I'm not going to spend loads of money today getting different, different hair products because it all racks up to be quite expensive. Here's what are you trying to make me spend money on? Afro hair cream. Yeah. This mm -hmm. comb, but not Afro hair comb. What for you like to get the sides to get the gel out? Of my the, hair. the fine tooth comb to get the gel out. But we can just wash the gel out. And I like it when Uncle Mark at the barbers yeah. flakes it all up and takes it all out. But I don't need to spend money doing that. We just wash it when we're at Let's home. See how much it is. One pound. Okay, we don't need to get that. Um, and you don't need another um, Afro comb because we've got plenty. We've got two at home, haven't we? Like In it. This one. Why do we need more? Because my own one. You've got your own one. The blue one is your one. I've lost it. All oh, right, that is the real problem because you've lost it. All oh, right, Hezzy trying to not smile. So whose fault is that? Mine. Oh. <laughs> oh. Blue. Oh, look at your face. <laughs> we'll see. Yes. What? What do you mean? We'll see doesn't mean yes. Okay, go on, get the afro comb. Just get the one though. Your mum mother is weak. So guys, um, we have finished uh, at Jessup's. Like we told you, obviously they, yeah, yeah. I hate being right sometimes, but all good. And we got the job from the hair shop and now it's time to go home. So you coming with us? Yes guys, so I've just stopped off to get on with some editing and Ella and the kids are going to get some cards, birthday cards. Who could they be for? You're going to find out in a minute. Hey guys, so we need to get a birthday card for... Who do we need to get birthday cards for? Uh, Auntie Elizabeth and Uncle Andre. Uh, my brother and sister, because it's Elizabeth's birthday tomorrow and Andre's birthday the day after. So we've come to Card Factory. Okay, so which one do you want for Uncle Andre? This one. This one? Happy yeah. birthday, yeah, that looks very nice. Was that the card, the envelope that came with it? Yeah. Okay, cool. I like this collection of cards. They're pretty cool. But you wanted to get one that says auntie, did you? I don't have to get one that says auntie. You don't have to, but you wanted to. This one's quite pretty, birthday girl. I just wanted to know. That one's cool. Auntie Rui, would you like this one? <laughs> Yeah, so you probably like this one. Yeah? Yeah, what right does it then. say? It says birthday girl. Papa, I don't think we need any confetti, sweetie. Can you put it back? All right, thank you for all your help. But you know, your brother is crying so much. Thank you. Oh, you want to do it yourself? 
Good, you can do it. Well done, you did it. High five. Sorry, I should have let you in the first place. Uh oh, try again. Go on, put it on. Good girl. Right, let's go. Let's go and pay now. Time to go home. Hey guys, so we have just got out of card factory i didn't even realize that we were in there just until they closed because we left out and then when i looked back behind me their lights were off in their shop so we got there just before they closed which is great anyway we got the cards that we needed so we're done and guys i think we're going home just to have tea and get kids to bed basically so we have finished our vlog for today thank you for traveling with us and doing whatever we did today you know i was in it and i can't even remember um <laughs> football and, and well we were at home. at home girls and i were just at home literally i was falling asleep trying to catch up on watching some of our own videos which i hadn't watched yet the girls did a bit of gymnastics and stuff anyhow i'm rambling on guys if you have liked our video please make sure you smash that like button and if you have and if you okay and if you want to leave any comments please leave them in the comments box below if you haven't done the dang dang wait 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 if you're not part of that notifications gang gang then do the bang and push that bell i think we said that right we have been the grim wade family closing out for another day peace peace Bring it up, prove me wrong.